saying goodbyes. Saying hello. You think your wife can hear you? No. Then why bother? Maybe I'm wrong. You're going to die. Maybe not. A large criminal organization has put a bounty on elite assassin John Wick's life and put those who have allied with him in danger. Now it's a race against time for John to keep his friends safe and find a way to keep an entire community of assassins off his back. Hey everyone, welcome back to Clubhouse Movies Podcast. I'm your host, Marco Wakawa, joined once again by Mr. Ayo Panetta. Today we'll be reviewing John Wick, Chapter 4, directed by Chad Stilinski. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. <laughs> okay, so... First and foremost, how do people take notes on iPads? Dude, I have no idea. Because my, I, my, my printer, my, my, go, my beautiful $50 printer <laughs> lost, like ran out of paper today. And I'm like, oh, I'll just upload to my iPad. This is what people do. And they, yeah. they upload their iPad and take notes. I got to like do this a bunch of times. Like I click that. I got to go up and down. And, and then I can't, I can't. It's hard to erase act- things. Then if you accidentally double tap something, you just yeah. zoomed in like a million percent. And I had to make sure this doesn't time out after 10 minutes. Otherwise, yeah. like I'll like lose everything. I have to start. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me while I enter my password and open out uh, Dolby. Let me, let me pinch the zoom my my <laughs> screen. I know. Okay. Well, gosh, man. That's that. Technology. So. Have you seen the John Wick movies before this? I all, have. All of them? So I saw every single one. I did not watch them in theaters. I saw them at home just because, you know, who has the time? <laughs> I Now we, we have to force the time. I feel like I've always wanted to do this where I watch every movie before the new one comes out. Yeah. I, ha- I, I have never seen a John Wick movie. I, I know. Which blew my mind. I know. that. Yeah. There was like a period I didn't watch movies and like I, I the, think that's when John Wick 1 came out. <laughs> the irony. Yeah. No, I have college, man. You're busy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> life <laughs> other things. but anyway uh, uh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, we're, uh, she's a mic just stack me yeah don't, don't i wasn't doing that in college god <laughs> <laughs> what intonation was that hot damn <laughs> where were we uh <laughs> my brain seriously stopped <laughs> All right, because uh, I remember like someone said he'd never seen the Lord of the Rings movies. <laughs> yeah. I said, "Why don't you see like all four like prequel movies, and yeah. then pick it up after that and see how that is?" But then that was when the first prequel movie came out, and I thought like, "Oh, maybe they'd be <laughs> good as they went along." Man, those got bad as they Wait, got along. The Hobbit movie, the Hobbit movies, yeah. Those were, I enjoyed watching them just to watch them, but those were a tough watch. I tried watching them again. Not gonna happen, Captain. I I fell asleep through every single one. <laughs> The, the the third one was a complete waste of time. I cannot begin to tell you what happened at all. It, in that one. Nothing happened. There wasn't even the Hobbit. In, like, what's his name? Bil- Bilbo wasn't yeah. even in it. Like, he he showed up at the end because he wasn't fighting the battle of the five armies. Yeah, what is he doing? He's running between their legs like a basketball. He's jacking off in the corner. I don't know. <laughs> Just flipping everybody off. He went to the <laughs> Hobbit strip club down the street. <laughs> no. Probably in downtown Long Beach somewhere. <laughs> Yeah, he, he he found the reverse magic ticket and got out of the movie and hung oh, out in our no. world for a little while. First. That's the other. Uh, the other trials of Mordor. <laughs> you go to this Mordor. awful place called Earth 2029. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, uh, but anyway, uh, so I saw all four John Wick movies within two days, including the Racy. That is burnout heaven. It's dude. This is this is it. I'm back. I'm back. Yeah, thinking I'm back. My coin. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Every assassin. Shut up and take my money. I will say it was a fun watch. <laughs> it was. It, it is a it is a good like I get it. Yeah. I, I who, get who doesn't want a Kevlar suit, first of all. Yeah, I I, I, I I get it. Like like uh, <laughs> one thing that I should say about this, yeah. characters are great. Yeah, story's great, and the, the the movies look really good. Yeah, they're they're well done. They're you you know, every frame is like a painting. Yeah, <laughs> what is that like? Multiple green and blue and pink lights yeah. everywhere. Like, you're like, just, oh just man, kind of like, like make, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's like Mortal Kombat and Triple X made a movie together. <laughs> you know, every, every, <laughs> I'm trying to think of what, it, what, it, what I was comparing this to, but. Uh, in my mind, but I, maybe I'll pick it up as we talk. And then every time, like that, John Wick, like, meow, 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 
<laughs> like like yeah. like like five five note string pops yeah. up I'm like oh yeah and then he's in Arabic it's like a little bit more Arabic yeah you're like, like he's back or, or if he's like <laughs> in Japan they play with the boom, yeah boom. They, they pluck it it's only like five <laughs> notes they're like oh he's back baby yeah it's like yeah I'm um, coming back but I have to say man did I have a killer headache. <laughs> Were you watching these? This one specifically, or these? all of them? Oh like, yeah! After the first, I'm like, yeah. Then like after like the next, the one, I'm like, yeah. Yeah. The next, <laughs> yeah. Like you get know? over the hump. <laughs> yeah. And then well, the other thing that I realized with all these movies is is if you ever think, well, maybe I don't need to see all of them before you watch. Them. Yes, you do. They all take place in like a month. Yeah, they do. You really have to watch them. You can't <laughs> just jump in. <laughs> and boy, like John, John Wick's like you know, like like, within that month, he's got ten years of city miles on his face. <laughs> city miles lost a finger. <laughs> oh yeah, right. You're like, like, whoa, Dude, great I, CGI on the finger, by the way. I started like getting pissed because like, I have to like look at his dismembered face. Dude, yeah. When I saw uh, Spider-Man three okay. and James Franco like got that bomb explode on his face and his face looked like crap. For oh, the rest of the God. Movie. I'm, like he's going to die. Like I can't look at this guy. Yeah. For the or, the or what was it? Uh, Topher Grace with that stupid like black well, he, symbiote yeah. in his face, but he wasn't coming back. So yeah, he looked terrible. <laughs> it's like someone threw bubble gum on his face, but it was fine. It was fun. Um, yeah. But it, after a while, I started turning to ASMR in my brain. Like, just, just like, bah, bah, bah. yeah, you're like, <laughs> and I started getting like sleepy. Like, oh, uh, yeah. So, yeah, I was like, I told you earlier, I was watching this movie in a very comfortable regal cinema <laughs> with the long sleepy chairs. Yeah. Hearing gunshots, guns loading, jackets going swing, swing, because the jackets make sounds here. <laughs> I hear, ba-ding, ba-ding, ba-ding. and I'm like, oh, this is this is comforting. And I caught myself snap uh, snapping <laughs> napping. Yeah, it's like <laughs> a couple no, times. So it's a good time to take a break that some of these action sequences but they just yeah. don't end. Yeah, uh, I actually had a potty break <laughs> it's because this movie was damn near three hours long and I was not prepared for that. Yeah, the other ones weren't as long as this. Yeah, uh, I am glad uh, for the last couple of uh, scenes in this movie though. Yeah, uh, it is a good movie, uh, but man, it was a lot of movie and uh, you know, <laughs> It was before I start getting into the yeah. story and whatnot. Uh, so this movie has it's a prologue, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I say John Wick, the Rat King, and the King of Assassins. <laughs> oh, right, the Rat King. I was like, who are we talking about here? So, so in the last installment, yeah. We, okay, maybe we'll kind of like just kind of recap because all this s- stories into one another. John Wick had left the life of being an elite assassin, mm-hmm. working for a larger. <laughs> assassin organization right to yeah. get married yep he got married had a happy life happy wife she got cancer and died yeah. right yep however uh before she died somehow she was able to commission a puppy being sent to him yeah and, and she said in a letter in a heart in a sad <laughs> sad letter yeah. that, that maybe now it's time for you to love something else and he had the puppy for three days Three days, or I don't know how many days. Something, yeah. Short amount of time. He was even post his wife's death. Yeah, the corpse was barely in the uh, ground. Theon Greyjoy from freaking Game of Thrones. He got his. He got his. By the way, in Game of Thrones, a bunch of times. Wanted to buy his car, like like a a sweet sweet, like Shelby Mustang. Yeah, Uh, he restored. The car is not for sale. Yeah, and then like he said, like Russian, like every car has his price, and then he's like, not this car yeah, or whatever. Back in Russian, he's like, yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. yeah, he's like, oh, this guy. So what they do is, and I think this is why the John Wick allure is so so much. Yeah, is that um, these guys they come, they mess him up, they kill his dog, and steal his car. Yeah, so this guy's already messed up. They kill his dog. Yeah, and uh, dog. John John Leguizamo in the first one. <laughs> Is uh he runs the like the chop shop yeah, and then like Theon came and I'm calling him Theon respectively because I I'm gonna do this a lot so they're, they're expect do a lot of Morpheus do your thing man <laughs> <laughs> and then Morpheus the Rat King yeah, Morpheus <laughs> it's, he's in it all the time man dude, he's, dude watching these you see all together, Morpheus and Neo together you're like come on <laughs> for a second there you start mixing them up. There was a scene where uh, in the third movie, and I remember these movies. Yeah. I saw them back to back, where uh, where Continental uh, manager guy, uh, I forgot his name, but uh, got a, got his name. Wait, the manager or the the, the, um, the manager, manager uh, Winston, man, manager Winston, played by yeah. Ian McShane, also in Game of Thrones, by the way. Um, he goes, "What are you gonna need?" And like in my brain, like I I said it, and, and then uh, he said it, guns, yeah. lots of guns. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <It's like> guns. <laughs> 
<laughs> <laughs> you know, Bill, like this movie. Get over here. I know this movie just like like crossed the fourth wall, <laughs> third wall, whatever. Yeah, it here. breaks your brain a little bit, man. Watching these movies. Yeah, and 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 then just to kind of summarize what happened. John yeah. Wick went on a on a on a rampage. Yeah, to get his car back. Killed a guy with a pencil. Killed a guy. <laughs> killed multiple people with pencils, <laughs> and then and then he keep he messed up the Russian mob. Yeah. <clears throat> Check, and then he went back home for a day or yeah. a, or a couple uh, of days. That's, that's when he gets called. Well, when he's doing that, they're like you. You stole Baba Yaga's car. It's like yeah, his son. <laughs> like yeah, I didn't realize Carlos Mancilla there. Yeah. <laughs> But you get the point. <laughs> the, the dad of the Cheech Marin. Yeah, the freaking dad of the uh, of the lead was it the lead Russian whatever his his son is the one who stole the freaking car. He's like, I cannot help you. You idiot. You idiot. But okay, so so just just to, to, that's movie one. He killed the, everyone in the Russian mob there. Yeah, who are apparently unrelated. And also there's this place called the Continental, mm-hmm. which is this badass hotel where uh, you can't kill people in the Continental. Yeah, it's sovereign ground. Or sovereign like ground. So then in the second one, he gets in and, and uh, this is where the, the story pivots to this trilogy of movies because that first one was just him getting revenge against the Russian mob in this one. Now he someone contracts him to do a job double crosses him. He kills him in the Continental and then becomes uh, excommunicado. He's excom- yep. and then that's when we find out that everyone apparently is an assassin in this world. Yeah, <laughs> like everybody. We're like, holy crap! Are there non assassins here? Yeah, everyone has a gold coin or something. And he keeps like working his way up to either become recommunicadoed. Yeah, <laughs> recommunicate <laughs> recommunicated in the uh, in the the life, and then gets excommunicadoed and then recommunicadoed. So yeah. we find him in a state of excommunicado at the beginning of John Wick Four, seemingly betrayed yeah. by his buddy. Uh, Ian McShane played by Winston after being shot off the thing. Yeah. But anyway, uh, he gets picked up by the Rat King. <laughs> back to the pre- <laughs> back Morbius. to the prologue. They yeah, have Morbius, the Rat King, King of the Bowery. Uh, <laughs> he nurses him back to health after being shot. You yeah. know, and he's just punching a punching bag. He's like, "You ready?" He's like, "Yeah, I'm ready." <laughs> You're back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, and he immediately goes into the desert to find the elder of the elite assassin uh, the table. Yeah, right because that's who he cut off his finger for in the last one. He's like I want to be recommunicated and I want my ring back. He's like we can't help you. <laughs> the ring is long gone. The ring is gone and you can't kill me. My death will mean as much as nothing is to nothing is. Yeah, reasons yeah, of course. reasons reasons <laughs> right in the face. Yeah, so so that's that ends the prologue. So he's uh, excommunicado again, or uh, maintains his excommunicado. However, now it himself uh, has come yeah. the uh, <laughs> the it man, the, the marquee. But I'll call him it in uh, yeah. before he's the clown human it human it yeah human it human it marquee <laughs> human it yeah uh, <laughs> comes to the Continental Hotel to tell uh, Winston that they are condemning the hotel. Yeah, and in doing so, shoots uh, Sharon the. Uh, yeah, uh, the, uh, Lan- played by Lance Reddick, who, who <laughs> I unfortunately died r- before this movie released. Yeah. Like we're talking maybe two weeks. This guy has been dead in real life and he died in the movie. It's so sad. Yeah, everyone's like, oh, that's too close. Do you remember in uh, the last Jedi Star Wars when they killed off seemingly killed off uh, Princess Leia by shooting her out of an airlock? Yeah, and everyone's like, oh my God, she's dead in real life too. Yeah, like, and then she's like, Jedi. Yeah, then she forces herself. She matrixes herself. Yeah, back he's like, the, what? Yeah, I don't know. I kind of wish like that was the end of it for her because that would have been like a sad like death. Yeah. Anyway, but anyway, this was a sad death because like we said, mentioned before, there's a lot of dogs mm-hmm. and a lot of like saving dogs. Sharon, the character, b- babysat his dog while John Wick was out getting his cans of whoop ass at the yeah. bar. You know. Yeah. And by the way, all through Look all this, mind watching John him. Wick must have killed like five, six, seven hundred people. Dude, he killed. So many guys. And he kills them like 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 an art form, like a like yeah. a ballet dancer. It's kind of like guns and knives, like equilibrium, but more hits and with better. The bullets. Yeah, <laughs> better and less dystopian. Face it, equilibrium sucks. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it. <laughs> if you want to see, it was a, good for its time. If you want to see another uh, a, a good Matrix esque movie, and I'm not gonna yeah. say clone because it came up for Dark City. Dark City. It, they're all in the same vein. Yeah, but no kung fu in Dark City. No kung fu. And no, no, no. Just uh, mind fu. No Christian Bale like dancing. I yeah. Don't know. Uh, but anyway. Oh boy, this movie. That's a lot. A lot, lot happens. There's a lot. It's a lot. So he finds out the only way. Yeah. Winston, Winston was excommunicated. Uh, also, because of everything that happened, and they destroy that hotel. So John Wick decides to go to the Continental in Japan, and. Then, <laughs> 
right? Then we meet the tracker and his dog. So another dog. So we know that somehow this dog will be in peril at some point in this movie. Also, tracker and his dog, a bunch of assassins because it's a continental. Yeah. The, no, no, I that. just realized the guy's name is Tracker. Yeah, in here. Yeah, he, he calls himself nobody. Really? In the movie? Yeah. Nobody was that other movie. No, he calls himself nobody. Another elite assassin who's part of a large. Oh group. right, good man. So much happening. All, All right. right. All uh, right. Uh, so, so, so the tracker or, or Mr. Nobody. Yeah, you're right. I think um, he's there. And then <laughs> and I'm just going to call him Scorpion yeah. so, because I think I think he's another it's Hiroyuki Sanada. Yeah. Uh, she, uh, Shimazu. Yeah. But he's he's the manager of this place. I don't know why he gets a name. And I guess Winston has a name too. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> Say he's the manager. Uh, yeah. So, so, so Scorpion uh, owes his friend a favor. He's like, if we only helped our friends. Uh, in in uh in times of need, we we do not need friends. Yeah, <laughs> it's like, or we we or something like that. If something of convenience. If whatever. we do not, yeah. If we do not help friends, uh, when it is inconvenient, then why have friends? Yeah, that kind of thing. So he he, he bails them out, and then they they condemn the the Tokyo Hotel. Yeah, and all through this, like people are. Oh dying. right, and when they condemn a hotel, I don't know if we covered it, but when they do this, the hotel explodes. They they bomb the hotels. Yeah, they they, they destroy the hotels. Yeah. So. Um. So everybody needs to be cleared out. Yeah, and in this case, uh, the uh, the marquee, it, yeah. <laughs> oh, it hires Ip. Oh, uh, ah. uh. <laughs> it hires Ip. So yeah. the IP man himself, Donnie Yen, plays Kane. Uh, <laughs> not to be uh, confused with Kane Kung Fu, but <laughs> Kane Donnie Yen. Uh, oh, also, man. another blind what swordsman. Is, is, is Donnie Yen blind? Why is he always playing? he's also blind in Star Wars? But I know uh, he's played like the same character he played in Star Wars. Yeah, what the freaking hell is happening? Yeah, here? I don't know. So he played the he played the blind. <laughs> he played the blind uh, samurai or yeah. blind ninja here, um, who kicks everyone's ass. Yeah, here. He's also a, he's a stick sword. Yeah. Uh, so they destroy it. Uh, he he kills um he kills Scorpion. Yeah, and his daughter uh, sees and she's all sad. And then he's like, oh, "When you want revenge, like mm. come find me." Yeah, he or rather, she was gonna attack him, and he says, "Live," as she's holding her dying father. Yeah, live. And he, then as he walks away, he's like, "I'll be waiting for you." <laughs> yeah, I know. And and he's you know the the Ip Man. Uh, yeah. yeah, okay. Kane it seems to be a man of honor. He seems to have been friends with John Wick at some point or another. Yeah. So John Wick goes back to New York somehow. <laughs> Yeah, did he swim? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, he just shows up there. He yeah, he's taking the bullet train, <laughs> and then he talks to Winston, who, by the way, last we saw, he saw Winston, who shot him. Yeah, right. Um, him and Winston and uh, Morpheus, Rat King guy. <laughs> yeah, they all, it, get, they all get together. Was he Bower? Was he called? Yeah, he's Bower King. So we'll call him Morpheus, Bower yeah. King, Rat King, that kind of thing. He says, "What you got to do is challenge it to a duel." Yeah. And he goes, oh, I can't. Uh, I Simpson lost. style. Get yeah. the white glove. <laughs> I lost my, I lost my, uh, what do you call it? <laughs> my family when yeah. I got the, because in the other movie, they cracked his, uh, the family who raised him or whatever. Oh, right. Trying to be assassin. He cracked the, the thing. And yeah. by the way, there's another tell yeah, that happened in another movie. That. We'll talk about it later. Um, so he's like, what you got to do is go back to Russia somehow. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> somehow. He ends up in Russia. Through the power of editing. <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> uh, and beg your family for for uh, co- uh you know convenience or whatever or yeah. forgiveness for forgiveness are my words too many beers to name too many beers not enough sleep <laughs> bad combination <laughs> the cure is in and out life in and out burgers oh I'm gonna get in and out sounds good you know you, you watch me I'm eating a burger three hours from now <laughs> oh, three hours from now man <laughs> whenever. Ah, they don't close till two, right? No, no. Oh man, they're right down the hill. What time is it? Eleven. Damn it! Oh no. <laughs> um, so, so he goes to Russia, and then he goes uh, to some church where all these Russian gangsters yeah. are hanging out, and they're like, "You dicks can be educated us." Oh, oh, this movie. I forgot. I didn't even write this in my notes. Oh, <laughs> okay. So they're like, they're like, yeah. Once you were excommunicated, we were excommunicated, and like freaking like butthead from Dick Tracy like came and like shot your uncle. So why don't you go shoot oh. butthead from Dick Tracy? Oh right, <laughs> right, right, and, and then we'll recommunicate. It really you. is butthead from Dick Tracy. Yeah, this is a whole like butthead he looked, situation. He, he looked like butthead Dick Tracy. This is a versus ma- uh, Colin Farrell's yeah, penguin. If you, yeah, if you've <laughs> ever seen Dick <laughs> Tracy, like the real life version one, it's it is so weird. Warren, like just just after Batman, like let's get us crazy comic books. Yeah, it was. Um, 
Oh man. So Damn, he goes, that yes. movie is like <laughs> So yeah, right? Call back. Man. So he goes he goes to this uh, nightclub where Butthead Dick Tracy plays poker with him. Yeah, who plays this character by the way? I, I should call him Farrell probably. probably. You know what? Probably, man. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea oh, who plays man. that guy. Butthead Dick, Tr- Dick Tracy. <laughs> so, you want to kill him? You want to kill him? I want to kill him. <laughs> what about you, Mr. Whip? I'm going to kill you. <laughs> For better, of course, yeah. But it looks like we have ourselves a... a genuine conundrum. <laughs> a quandary, if you will. A real-life dilemma. <laughs> so... I thought we'd play our game. One hand. The winner decides who lives. And who does not? <laughs> but this mo- this scene went on for like four hours. Oh the- my god, it was so lo- it was unnecessarily it long. It was so long. And the fight was so damn long. <laughs> well, the fight is long because like John Wick is a long fight, but like he's like, we we play pool, you know, we play poker. Let's see yeah. who wins the poker. And yeah. it and it, it just turns into a fight. Like yeah. after after three hours, mind of, you, playing poker with a blind guy. He's yeah, playing po- poker with a blind guy and the tracker guy. Yeah, and then they're like, oh, ha, 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 poker, poker. <laughs> I don't even know what the heck happened. And then John Wick slices that guy's neck with a freaking playing card. Yes, like he just holds it. And it's like the slowest movement. He's like. Ugh. And the I, guy's I, like, oh, we're like, what? I totally forgot about this part. Yeah. <laughs> it happened. My brain like wiped this part away. Dude, <laughs> I saw it happen. I was just like, what? I'm like, did I just see that happen? <laughs> and the character looks so weird. Yeah. I was like, oh no, you made it through his fat prosthetics. <laughs> It's like this is odd. And then he killed him and stole his like his teeth. Dude, yeah, he like <laughs> threw him down a flight of stairs and landed on his head. No, we'll talk oh, about we'll talk about Scorpion stairs. that guy. We'll t- yeah, get over Mike, here. And that was after John Wick had been thrown off of a second floor party dance floor. By the way, a, the oh, da- onto a concrete cylinder the, the, and then he fell off. It's a nightclub. The dancers are like dancing this whole time. Oh yeah. <laughs> Completely like While goons are going back and forth. People like are gun fighting. Shots, gun shots, freaking hatches flying through the air. They're the, like the, they're like, oh no, dance it. It's the Sims. I seriously it's yeah, the they're, they're all NPCs. <laughs> I actually think that uh, everyone is an assassin in this world, and somehow like there's an assassin-based economy or something. Yeah, and they're all just dancing, going, "Oh man, this is like a another Tuesday, just another Tuesday, Tuesday is Tuesday ever." So <laughs> he, right. so he takes Dick Tracy butthead guy, yeah. uh, <laughs> takes his teeth, <laughs> takes his teeth, his coke teeth, literally probably this time. <laughs> I don't, honestly don't know what that his means. Giant he gold teeth. Says it. His <laughs> giant gold teeth. His giant gold teeth back to his Russian family. They're like, you are recommunicated. And he puts yeah. like a brand on his arm. You, his, they only hand cousin. him one. Like, he hands them one tooth. That's what I was thinking. And the lady's like looks at it and she, I don't What the hell was she doing before building like a gun? I don't know. Something. She was lighting candles or whatever. Like, He's like, would you like to look at this tooth? Yeah. <laughs> she's. <laughs> and she she has this smirk from being super serious Russian lady. And she's like, I know exactly what this is. And everyone's like, what is it? <laughs> it's a golden nugget. <laughs> you should have taken the selfie. What they took his tooth. <laughs> took his selfie. Yeah, you got a phone, John. Shaka bra. Yeah. <laughs> Shaka bra. Oh, man. <laughs> so stupid. Uh. <laughs> Oh man, Bill and Ted moment right there. I don't know. I think it's more <laughs> South Park, but well, no, because he's <laughs> oh, wow, righteous. The rhymes of that time. I, anyway, uh, so he's recommunicated. <laughs> yep. Then he everything's go- back on track. Yeah, everything's back on track, and he goes okay. And, and somehow uh, Winston and the Rat King show up. Morpheus yeah. the Rat King, and they're like, okay, well, it's time to like you know. D- it's time to uh, declare you're going to fight the guy. Yeah. And he goes, yeah, I can, I can fight you in a duel. And then he's like, like, ah, you can't fight me in a duel because you're not part of a royal family. And he goes, ah! and he's like, look oh, at my burn marks. Yeah! I'm John Wick. <laughs> and, I know. And by the way, John Wick keeps on getting excommunicated and recommunicated like all yeah, the time man. in this movie. This so it's like a bad cell phone reception. <laughs> I know. Right? <laughs> he's tripping and coming in. Oh, so so he is so uh, because he's part of the royal family. He accepts and, and makes uh. Uh, Donnie Yen, the uh, his uh, his number his two. champion, yeah, his champion. Um, and then they choose pistols at at sunrise. Yeah, and they're playing like this card game. It's like go fish. Who's right, gonna pull? they're literally sitting at this like another card game. It's like they're sitting at the Louvre, just like with yeah. those two tables, and they have 
the guy, uh, what is it? Um, Harbinger, played by Clancy Brown, just standing there going, rrr, rrr, rrr. You come here thinking there's a way out of this world, Mr. Wick. There is not. Let me uh, flip around these cards for you. Sakura card. Sacred cord is weapons. If you win, the table will honor its word. You will have your freedom, but you won't take it. Blades. Pistols. Dueling pistols. 30 paces. In the event that both parties survive, each will approach the other at increments of 10 paces until only one remains. Mm. I was or, I was waiting for that to be his dad or something. I expected him to bark. Well, he had he had what he was missing a finger too. Yeah, well, because he was a he was an assassin also. Yeah, you know that's not a trigger finger, so you don't need it. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, so he's standing there and they're playing they're playing charades. <laughs> he's yeah, like, you don't understand what. What's his face? What Marquis is saying, Bill Skarsgård's character, like because his fake, oh, fake French, French accent, accent is of the worst. Like the worst. <laughs> He's like, I will twist my mustache. Georgie, <laughs> <laughs> they should have just had Shasta Baron Cohen play him. Damn it, <laughs> it would have been so much better. He would have sold it. But 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 I think Sasha Baron Cohen. Sasha Bar- that Baron Cohen. Baron Sasha Baron Cohen looks yeah. more menacing than him. Yeah, he does, especially because he can actually grow the snidely whiplash yeah. mustache. I feel like if I got into a fight with Bill Skarsgård, um, you know, well, you could see a punch coming both ways because yeah. like, <laughs> you saw that punch coming from last week. <laughs> from last week, <laughs> was Dave Chappelle. That was pretty good. <laughs> I saw that punch coming from last week. <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I don't want speaking wanna, of coke teeth, dude, like. <laughs> After speaking of Dave Chappelle, like I don't want to like talk shit. Like you know, maybe like maybe Bill Skarsgård can fight after we found out what happened with Prince and Charlie Murphy. You never know, man. Hey, <laughs> yeah. yeah, you never yeah, know, I don't man. know, man. But I'm just saying, like, hey, man. if I had to fight one of them, Sasha Baron Cohen or Bill Skarsgård, yeah. Bill Skarsgård, like, put up your dukes. Yeah, he just he's got he's got length on him. That's it, man. Plus, I'm afraid like get in the clinch. Sasha Baron Cohen would do some like Borat stuff or yeah. like, some like Bruno <laughs> stuff. <laughs> He put his finger somewhere. You're like, get away from me! I know, right? You're like, this man has no morals. <laughs> woo, the man code is gone. Woo, woo, woo. It's not one guy you want. It's another Chappelle reference. This is one cat you want to What is be, happening right now? Running behind you. <laughs> <laughs> this show is on fire. Oh boy, I didn't expect this. Oh, these man. Chappelle references. <laughs> So anyway, oh, man. He, uh, IP man is champion for it's obvious hot. reasons. <laughs> um, and then and then uh, since Bill Skarsgård is the current head of the table yeah. of the assassin order, he gets his like DJ to be like, hey, you cats out there. I'm going to yeah. play. I'm going to play you painted black and French and <laughs> John, like, for John Wick's like, head. We're going to paint it red. And you're yeah. like, wait a minute. That's painted black. though. I, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> he purposely changed it black. Yeah. Anyway, uh, he's like, we're going to raise this uh, kill clock to five million dollars and everyone in France is after this dude. They're like, oh, and the, the, uh, the, the rat blue. The, yeah, the rat king at Winston gave him like a new suit. That's even yeah. more bulletproof than he, he, does, he does like a bunch of Batman. Like, yeah, he does the Batman. He does a bunch of Batman. He's a dark wing duck out there. <laughs> yeah, putting his forearm in, like he's coughing all the time, but yeah. like getting riddled. Yeah, when blows. he's shooting people, he's like, yeah, so so literally all of France is after him at this point. Um. And this is so he, he the, the thing is he's trying to get back to where he came from. I don't yeah. know. I guess they would kill him there if he stayed the night. He's trying to get back to the 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 the, the, the terrorist Louvre or whatever. Yeah. Uh, and they're trying to stop him before uh, five. Yeah, before, before sunrise. Before sunrise. Yeah. And man, this guy gets into one fight, two fight, three fight, four fight, five man. fight. This time. And then the count back there. One. Ooh. <laughs> I know. <laughs> just just it just. That's all it is. It's all it is. Oh. <laughs> and, then, and, then, and then just at some point, I think it's like comical. This, yeah, and at some point in this fight, either one of the fights, uh, someone tries to kill Tracker's dog, but John yeah. Wick saves Tracker's dog. Yeah, by because, shooting the guy who's also wearing a bulletproof suit, by the way. Yeah. Uh, every, uh, by the way, all these guys had like high water gray suits mm-hmm. that were all bulletproof. You're like, what is going on right now? I know, right? 
They, they, they used to say that the, uh, even when you got shot with a bulletproof suit, it still hurts. No, yeah. this didn't hurt. It was just no. like, it was like a feather. Like everyone's having a big pillow fight. Yeah. And then everyone's when you get like, shot in the head, oh. you're done for. Yeah. Everyone's like, no, we don't have broken ribs or ruptured spleens or anything. Yeah. It's just all good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good. Concussion does not exist. Um, and, and then, uh, and then I think from this point on, uh, I was like really into the movie because like, <laughs> it at least changed because yeah at the very end was like the freaking exorcist stairs, but like it kept on going. Remember that scene in Ace Ventura yeah. where like the stairs go to the Tibetan oh, right. monastery <laughs> and then they had the slinky. Yeah, yeah, he had to go up those stairs. Yeah, those stairs. And <laughs> then he got thrown down there one time. <laughs> one time he th- he got thrown down like a few times and one was like comic like and then <laughs> and the guy who did it like just starts sliding down because it's stairs and then on the sides of them. It's like just a little ramp just a ramp. Yeah, so the guys just sliding down like a skateboarder. We're like, What's happening here, man? I, turns out John Wick's uh, only weaknesses is dogs and <laughs> stairs. Yeah, <laughs> can't go upstairs. Yeah, don't don't kill his dog. <laughs> oh his man, day. no! Uh, at least don't kill his dog up some steps. <laughs> ruin his day. Yeah, and so okay, and somehow oh yeah, Donnie Yen saves him, it, yeah. man, because he if he doesn't come, then that's the end of like the game anyway. Yeah. And plus, he's a man of honor, you know, yeah. he, and he wants to make sure like this goes through and like this is, an, you know, there's no honor in yeah. what they're doing. And then uh, I think even, um, oh, even uh tracker guy, he has a, his nice sniper rifle. Yeah. And he's like, you know, uh, he's like, you save my dog. I'll save you. Yeah. So he's killing bad guys too because like John Wick is freaking tired at this point. Yeah. So, yeah. So, so tracker actually takes out the guy who's throwing John Wick down the stairs. He's like the tallest Spanish man in the world apart from that one movie we saw no, with yeah. the basketball player and Adam Sandler. That was weird. That um, was weird. <laughs> that was weird. Dude, it's been a weird, oh, weird man. movies. A lot of movies. Between movies. <laughs> They're all one long movie. Now. Stanley Sugarman. There we go. Looking, Stanley. looking for a NBA. <laughs> I'm looking for a stock. It, it's, you know, it's even weirder. There's a movie with Ben Affleck. Uh, courting uh, Michael Jordan for the Nike. Oh show. man, it's so weird. It's so weird. That's the trailer I saw. What is it called? Air or something? Air, yeah. Just or air. Want to pull a hot air. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah. So so uh, <laughs> so Tracker takes out that guy, and then uh, Donnie Yen helps take out the other guys. And just as they arrive at the uh, you know the top of these stairs, the dueling. Donnie, uh, yeah, the dueling steps. We'll call it. Donnie Yen shanks him right in the freaking hand. He's like, I owed you one. He's like, oh, I'm back. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> What's happening? I know this movie is a bananas with a capital B. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that's a lot. Okay, so and I think I was actually happy that this was like the finale of the movie because it was quiet and like it peaceful. Was, it was long. It was long, but I, I got it. Yeah, uh, they do duels. They do the pistols at dawn. Yeah, uh, which is nice. And uh, what other movie ended this way? Because like you know like the Matrix Resurrection, uh, the Matrix. Uh, that was the last one. Like the last Revolutions. One oh Re- no, the last Re- one. We s- no, 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 not the not the latest. You're right, Revolutions. Yeah, Matrix Revolutions. Revolutions. Yeah. Like the last final fight was between Mr. Smith. Oh right, and it was just Mr. like Mr. Anderson. And Mr. Anderson, Neo was just a fist fight, like just more action. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Yeah. So this one was nice because it was like just a quiet, like like yeah, like, like pacing. Like no crazy sound music, just like guns loading things. Yeah, so it's 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 uh you know it's thirty paces and then ten paces. Yeah, after and then each speaking miss. of ASMR, you have freaking uh, Clancy Brown's voice. Thirty paces, thirty paces. <laughs> You're like, say it again, please. <laughs> I know, right? Why isn't there more Clancy Brown? I feel like, I know. I feel like we only see Clancy Brown once every five years. Yeah, and and it's always in something weird. He makes just <laughs> enough money to stay afloat. But why isn't he like in more movies? He's probably, why isn't he a captain of the Enterprise? He's like, I'm old. Why isn't he in Star Wars? Yeah. Why isn't he in Marvel? Yeah, right. The, the, he he should have been Thanos. He should not even Thanos. Well, maybe Thanos, but he could have been Thunderbolt. Like, yeah, he could have been Thunderbolt. Yeah, like, he could still be Thunderbolt. Not anymore. We've entered Harrison the Ford. multiverse now. That's that guy's true. Older than dirt, <laughs> man. And dirt's pretty goddamn yeah. old. <laughs> <laughs> we know Indy found it. <laughs> yeah, in his pants, <laughs> man. Anyway, <laughs> all right. <laughs> uh, so pistols at dawn. They yeah. they do thirty paces first. They shoot and then they they kind of get wounded, but kind of not really. Yeah, and then twenty. I think Johnny yeah, Johnny wow. Donnie <laughs> Donnie. Yeah, I was gonna call him it Johnny man. Wick. Yeah, it man gets hit in the hip. Yeah, and then uh, what is it? Then the se- no, yeah. So he gets hit in the arm. John Wick in the shoulder. The next one, it's like hit both of them. I guess. Yeah. Uh, oh no, um, <laughs> Donnie Yen misses the second one. Yeah, Donnie and misses, and then it just sort of ends with uh, John Wick getting hit in the hip, yeah, and getting hit in the shoulder, yeah. uh, 
and uh and then what's his name um uh, uh it uh oh, yeah um, it, the uh the marquee marquee's like I shall be do the coup de grace. Yeah, I, I shall I shall uh, like, finish put this. the last bullet. I in. will do the finale. I put yeah. the last bullet in him and he, and he takes the gun from it man. Then Ian McShane's Winston starts laughing. <laughs> you idiot. Like, yeah, <laughs> you arrogant bastard or something like that. You arrogant bastard. You pompous bastard. <laughs> he didn't fire his gun. It's like what? <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. I know right uh, and then uh, what does John Wick say at the end? He, he said a line. He said, uh, that's payback or something like that. Something akin to that. <laughs> Hasta la vista, <laughs> baby. <Pretty> much. <laughs> whoa. <Yeah. laughs> Even he said whoa to himself. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> You're fired. What was another big catchphrase? It's still on. Adrian. Oh, Adrian. <laughs> Adrian. <laughs> Adrian. <laughs> Sorry for your ears, everybody. <laughs> Get to the job. <laughs> Does Stallone have a catchphrase? I don't know. I can think. move my mouth. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think it's Adrian. It is Adrian, but that's not like an action movie. Like. No, it's not. Like he it's, it, He did Rambo. Like yes, <laughs> what's this Rambo line? Let's see. Oh, Rambo. What did Rambo say? Famous like, Rambo. Rambo. Famous Rambo. Rambo quotes. Let's see these things here. <laughs> <laughs> I could have killed them all. Could have killed you. No, okay. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Lame. Uh, we didn't know okay. <laughs> nothing is over. I was thinking I was thinking about the expendables. Oh, yeah, where uh, it was uh, Bruce Willis and Arnold Schwarzenegger and then Arnold Schwarzenegger is like I'll be back and then Bruce Willis is like no, I'll, I'll be back. You've been back enough <laughs> and then he runs away and then, <laughs> forgot about that. And then, then Arnold Schwarzenegger is like hippie K.A. <laughs> yeah, that, something like that. <laughs> something like that. Dude, I forgot about those movies, man. They're making. They were making a f- another one, from what I remember. Yeah, they probably I saw were. it on Shop Talk Movie News. Ah, yeah, <laughs> weekly. I'm close. Check podcast. in, <laughs> <laughs> like, subscribe. Yeah, like, subscribe. <laughs> we're out every week or so. Yeah, hashtag Penny is real. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, where, where were we this movie? Okay, so uh, John Wick, he's wounded. Yeah, uh, he's shot in the hip and the shoulder. Yeah, and he takes out Marquise with a headshot. With a headshot, uh, and then he he walks over to the steps, and at some point he did tell. Uh, uh, well, before all this happens, so you know Don Yen is like, "Hey, do you know Don Yen's whole shtick was his daughter?" Mm-hmm. So he gets now he gets by um, what's his face by the Harbinger played by just Clancy Brown. He's like, "All right, all your debts are settled. Whatever, go to your daughter." And then they're like, "John Wick, you are a communicado." Recommunicado. You're, yeah, you're recommunicado and recommunicated. Uh, yeah, and then Winston, your hotel is back. We on our dime and all this stuff because that was his his bit in it. And he's like, mm-hmm. I'll be your number two if I get my hotel on their dime. So he got his hotel back on their dime. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now so we, uh, all is well. Yes. Uh, and then uh, at some point before this, also um, John Wick said, "On my tombstone, tell him I was a loving husband." Yeah. That's what I want on my tombstone. So uh, you see him just sitting there on the steps. And then fading out, and yeah. then he falls over, falls over, and uh, apparently dies. Yeah. Um, and then we cut to his tombstone with the Rat King yep. and Winston. Uh, like, oh, and there it is. I never thought I'd see John Wick's tombstone as yeah. I live and breathe. Yep. And then you, then the dog that's sitting next to Winston goes, Roo! yeah. You saw that, right? Yeah. Like he went Roo! and looked looked over. Yeah. Yeah. And then cut to credits. You're like, why? Well, okay. So so I saw the I had the the uh, the honor. Of Oops. watching all these movies before, yeah. Uh, if you remember in John Wick Chapter Three, uh, right before he was excommunicado with the big countdown, yeah, uh, he had a big knife slash in his, oh, right, in his stomach did. and went to a doctor, yeah. And then the the doctor was sewing him up, and then 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 the countdown went off, yeah. So he had to finish himself up, oh. and the doctor says like they'll never believe that I didn't help you like in time. And he said, you know what you have to do, and he handed him a gun, and he says you have to shoot me right here, which is that spot that John Wick got shot, yeah. And right here, yeah, right, right in the right in the gut and right Whoa. in the shoulder, and then like that'll miss every like artery. So it's like an old like assassin's trick. Whoa! So John Wick is very much alive. Yeah, uh, and uh, it, just because that that happened, I, I the, hadn't seen that movie since it came out. So I saw that movie yesterday. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> not the fourth one, the third one. I I saw that movie. <laughs> I mean, it could have been all two one hours before I saw that one. <laughs> I was like, "Woo! Let's do this!" John Man. Wick chapter. Everyone, take a shot when he shoots somebody. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> I am 100 percent blood alcohol. I can't breathe. <laughs> Nobody light a match. <laughs> <laughs> I'm burping fire. 
Oh my god. <laughs> my blood. Oh, my precious blood. <laughs> my bottle of alcohol is jaundice. <laughs> anyway. Yellow bastard. Yeah. Uh, and then the post credit sequence, like we alluded yeah. to earlier, uh, was uh, Scorpion's uh, daughter. Like, okay. like given the given the evil eye, ice grilling uh, the Ip Man oh. and his daughter playing the uh, the the violin. And yeah. then, by the way, at the uh-huh. very end, uh-huh. past the credits, past the there was like, another one, past the rated R. Yeah, like this movie was rated R, and then everyone right, was like, leaving. Duh. Then it finally said, uh, in you know, in in memory of Lance Reddick. Oh. So like literally like tagged onto the very all end of the, the movie. way at the end. They should so have done it at the beginning. I think the movie was like locked. Yeah. So all they yeah. can do was like, yeah, plug it in like like hey. literally plug it in like a movie trailer. Yeah, they probably <laughs> sent the like the, the file to all the theaters. We're like, here, download this, please. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. <laughs> literally drag and drop. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> drag and drop. Everyone uh, can get Da Vinci Resolve. It's free. I know, right? <laughs> free and good. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember Final Cut Pro? Is that even a thing anymore, dude? Why? Yeah, I was like, is it still a thing? Yeah, people still pay for this. Final Cut Pro, like, I don't know why. Da Vinci Resolve, fantastic. Thing. Yeah, it's the it's resolves the so quickly. <laughs> <laughs> ah, <laughs> look at the camera and wink. <laughs> Wait, wait, where's the button? You you do it. The ding. Yeah, it resolves so quickly. I like it. <laughs> oh, oh my god. This yeah, movie. so that was this movie. It's a lot of movie. It was a lot of movie. Look at the countdown has either been two hours or five minutes. I don't know. <laughs> 46 minutes. Okay. Ah, we're on track. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've been sitting here talking about this movie. Like we I don't this agree. movie just became four hours long. We blew through like all the John Wick movies in yeah. like, a moment. Yeah, uh, but, that, but that's it. Uh, yeah. It was fun enough. Yeah. So I'm going to give it a B minus John Wick. Chapter four is another fun sequel in the world of elite assassins. This being the fourth movie where John Wick is still fighting nameless goons for the same reasons left me wanting more. Please shake it up in the next movie. All right. That was good. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm also going to give this one a B minus. Uh, my one gripe with this movie it was way too long. Uh, but other than that, I really enjoyed it. I mean, you can't go wrong with a tried and true formula like John Wick. One, everyone loves Keanu Reeves. Check. You got Keanu Reeves actually doing his own stunts driving. Check. Whoa. You got him doing his gun stunts. You got him doing his little jujitsu, which is near and dear to my heart. So seeing John Wick, aka Keanu Reeves, just doing his thing constantly, consistently while getting beat up semi realistically. It just draws you in, but hey, you know, we've seen it once. We've seen it again. So please, please make it a little bit different. You know, though, I've been thinking I didn't want to fault this movie or most movies for being too long just because I feel like that's the movie they wanted to make. Yeah, no, I I can see that, but it's the thing is they've done it three other times. Yeah, and, and I and I do agree. They should have cut up that uh, butthead Dick Tracy scene. Yeah, or cut it. I don't know. It, some of these scenes didn't belong in the movie. There's a scene in Indiana Jones. Yeah, where there's where he runs into this swordsman, and the swordsman does this ah, and does like a bunch of like oh, movies, right, yeah, like show like how badass he is. And they say they actually like filmed it, like or they, in the script he was supposed to fight the swordsman. Oh, right, but like they they either ran out of time or like some like and he shot him, right? Yeah, George, well George Lucas is like why didn't you shoot him? Yeah, like at some point, like, you know, why, why didn't you shoot him? Yeah. <laughs> so poetry, and, and, and he just said he just shot him, and it was like the best scene in the movie. And apparently, the, the swordsman actor was so mad because he was like the best swordsman in, yeah. in the world. I don't know. I was like, "Well, sorry, buddy, you <laughs> can't beat Indiana Jones." Him and his Alibaba sword got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> got nothing on, oh, on no. Indiana Jones and his gun. Oh man, <laughs> one step ahead of the bad guys. <laughs> Freaking Aladdin over <laughs> here. Yeah, <I> know. <laughs> Oh, damn. That was good. I don't think you'll like that. <laughs> what did you say? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> he didn't like the bullet. <laughs> did, they, did they ever finally get rid of uh, it's savage, but hey, it's home. I don't, no, I think it's still in there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, it's probably in the video game, too, which is fantastic. <laughs> Like John Wick literally went to the like uh, Anza bar for like a minute <laughs> in this did. movie. <laughs> I know it started like he's doing that. I'm like, what is going on right now? He went like, I'm like am I the, the right movie? <laughs> no one thought to kill him on the airplane or at the airport or like yeah. however he got like <laughs> he just teleports everywhere, man. <laughs> he's like, like bullets. I'm here like Batman, like uh, getting back, you know, wherever. <laughs> oh, yes. from, but I, 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 I can imagine how Batman got back. 
Yeah. Because he wasn't a wanted man. In this, like, like yeah, Bruce he could just take his suit off and be like, hey, I'm just going to take dude. a trip back to wherever I want. Yeah. John Wick is like, I don't wear a mask. Yeah. Get the same creasy hair and black suit. Johnny Dark suit. <laughs> Johnny Dark suit. <laughs> <laughs> Last suit you ever wear. Oh, Getting man. married and being put in the grave. Mm-hmm. Some would say they're the same thing. Mm-hmm. But anyway. Nice. Uh, remember to like, share, subscribe. Check us out on Twitter, Facebook, wherever you are. We are been on our, YouTube. We are up. Oh, oh, yeah. We'll talk later. Uh, <laughs> anyway, that has been our hot take on John Wick Chapter 4. I think the next one should be called John Wick Resurrection. Ooh. Even though every movie is called. Revolutions. <laughs> Revolutions. <laughs> of the gun. Yeah. John Wick Reloaded. <laughs> yeah, Reloaded. <laughs> John Wick Part Trapped in Time. <laughs> John Wick. The Fathom Event. John Wick Point Break. <laughs> point, point Break. <laughs> John Wick, the Neo Chronicles. <laughs> That's another good one. John Wick chasing the rabbit. <laughs> What's another good Keanu Reeves movie? I'm trying to think. John Wick, an excellent adventure. <laughs> John Wick's excellent adventure. <laughs> oh, oh, that's another thing I was gonna say. Uh, John Wick. What's a stupid movie he came out with? Uh, with uh, what's her stupid name? Sandra. Johnny Bullock? Mnemonic. Johnny Mnemonic, dude. <laughs> I don't know if that was it, but no. Let's see. Uh, Speed. Did 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 did. Stay above 50. Stay above 50. <laughs> speed. Stay above 50. Let's see. What other movies? I don't know if I have time. Can't reset it. Oh, so. Stay above. What's this called? Oh, I know what it's called. John Wick, The Lake House. <laughs> oh, I was saying Super Pets. <laughs> super Pets. <laughs> John Wick Super Pets. Where he plays an awful tired Batman. Oh, Batman man. Yeah, The Lake House was pretty gnarly. Dude, never saw that movie. I think there were like YouTube videos of like the interviews for the press and like, hey, describe just <laughs> describe to us the plot of the lake house. There's this magic mailbox where you put mail in and it goes back and talk. <laughs> Whoa. John Wick, the replacements. Anyway, hey. I'm your host, Mark Rule Cover Joy once again my Mr. Open Ever Clubhouse Movies Podcast. We'll catch you next time. Oh. You should shoot Constantine. Constantine. I never saw that one either.